All right, okay, let me see if I can drive the point this way. Imagine that you're with your friends playing um, like a war game, a paintball. I don't know if you've ever seen that. You go hiking and you start and you you see splatters of paint uh, on trees and uh, and you realize that a couple of um, a couple of teams just uh, were just there playing paintball wars. Let's say that instead of it being um, um, a war game that you're playing with your friends, it's something that could be a positive thing. You know, you don't not necessarily means that your uh, one team is trying to attack, surprise attack the other team, but maybe you're trying to surprise. Uh, the other team for a good reason. Let's leave out of the equation whether it's uh, a good, uh, beneficial uh, kind of a surprise team sport game or a war destructive seize and take prisoner the opposite um, team kind of uh, war game and just Think of the aspect that is about planning with your own team um, how to how to um, ambush the the other team, and then imagine that while your team um, while your team was preparing, planning, scheming, lowering your voice you know, uh, drawing plans, looking around to see if they, anybody in the other team found you, all along the other team had positioned themselves in a place where they were watching everything you were doing. And while you thought you were being secretive, the other team was just kind of like, you know, <laughs> hanging out, kind of uh, keeping their voice down and laughing about, you know, showing each other what your team was doing and how uh, you weren't able to see that they you were actually uh, that, that they were actually watching you guys okay imagine the moment try to make this a, a realistic what happens for example if in the team that's quietly planning thinking that he's not has not been discovered somebody comes to the group and says, you guys, they're all around us, they've been watching us, they're, don't turn around, but they're looking at, they're all, all of us are looking at us, all of them are looking at us right now, and put yourself in that situation, what, it kind of throws everything, uh, change, it's a total uh, game changer, it changes the reality and the perspective of everything, all of a sudden it, it's like starting from scratch. Nothing means anything anymore. You, you have to start all over as to what to do from that point on <laughs> because everything has been diffused, right? Um, well, that's kind of the, that's a, a good metaphor for the reality about alien or uh, extraterrestrial intelligent life beyond our world. S scientifically, statistically, uh, we can demonstrate that 99.999 billion percent uh, it is probable that it is uh, the opposite to what we think. We have been being uh, observed and uh, because if once you turn it around, once you put yourself, in the on the side of the other team of the team that has been watching how we were so credulously uh, quietly planning uh, our our um, our assault on the team uh, that th did not know what we're up to what we're doing but in reality they were aware of us it changes everything to the point where if you put yourself on the side of the team that is seeing everything that you're doing but the ones that have been discovered are not aware of that yet 
that they they think they're still not seen um that they still have to find where the other team is and and uh, they're hoping they're not going to get found first you know um if you put yourself on the other side you can actually you know uh plan things you can um you have a, a lot more um power of influence you can start messing with them. You can start messing with that other team and have them believe that maybe you think you know where they're at. So they go, oh, look, look, hurry. They're, they're about to find us, says your team, right? And then in reality, they're just actually provoking you and pushing you um, to go in a certain direction or to do something. It just changes the reality completely. And this uh, new start is kind of like uh, where we are at. What our, what our reality is before the idea of intelligence beyond our world. It is not about us discovering them. It is about realizing that we have always uh, been known and have been either their will, their plan, um, their lack of interest, <laughs> you know. It, it is not us still like trying to approach their existence and and because that entails that maybe they don't know about us it's a very hard you know that what I'm, this is the fourth video i make on this and what is most interesting to me what it, what it actually is starting to grab my my imagination my intelligence to try to figure out why is it so difficult to articulate this simple point why do i not find vocabulary and words that easily with a few sentences get this point across why did i have to make a paintball war example to try to take people's imagination into seeing the reversal of the situation uh, i think that is very interesting but i don't know if it has to do with linguistics because i often notice how um we don't have words for things that we have not been much in history towards each other or about the way we think towards the world we don't actually have we have the words that we're familiar with our behavior uh for but um we don't seem to have words for things that we're unexperienced and you wonder which came first the chicken or the egg you wonder if if it's we haven't been more like that because we didn't have the vocabulary or our vocabulary is simply the result of uh, the extents in which we have behaved towards one another, which is an interesting subject in itself, nothing to do with this. But I wonder if there is a little bit of a connection there. Why is it so difficult to uh, describe the reversal of the situation or the inversion, um, and therefore leading to a difficulty in, in, in conversations that would start from that point on what does that mean being that it's a complete rule changer complete game changer of uh, the whole of our self-perception as humanity on this world um it's can it's mind-boggling it seems that all words become small when you start thinking about well, well that means that you know all of a sudden it, it is kind of ridiculous that we're fighting each other as nations as people while somebody else is watching you <laughs> you know all of a sudden we become small and our conscience perhaps becomes more stimulated um to take our world more seriously it's amazing it really creates it's an, an incredible concept to apply upon our um condition our human condition but okay so um, that's it um, that's another one i'm kind of going over and over with the same the same uh point the same uh completion of uh of the equation with uh, different takes on it